Does it scare you at all, like, hypothetically, or if you were to lose to Jake Paul, that that would hurt, like, your legacy or anything like nah, that? No, I don't think definitely it would. not. I think fighters fight, yeah. you know? It's a, it's a mission, you know? That's what I put in my mind. It's a mission. It, you, sometimes you you have a, the, the soldiers, and you train your soldiers for the mission, and sometimes you lose the mission. Mm. Sometimes you fail. Sometimes you win. Yeah. But I train you for win. Mm. You know, I don't train you for lose. Yeah. I train you for win. And the, the fights happen. I'm win. Okay, I'm win. I'm lose. Keep keep doing. Let's go. I don't go lose. Right. Trust me. Can I don't you go please lose. make him a meme for us? Yeah. I just want someone to make him a meme. I want to knock out me with Jake Paul. I want him knocked out. Like you know. I, I mean, it'd be pretty. I, don't know it'd be, what, I mean, I don't it'd be crazy. I, I don't know. I go and knock out the Jake Paul or not, but I, I promise. I go prove my respect for boxing world. That's my yeah. goal. You know, that's uh, I train with the the gold Olympic game guy in the boxing. Yeah, that's I training for professional uh, boxers. That's I doing uh, my best every day. That's I I I receive the 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 phone call to Canelo to uh, say, oh, continue. I know you respect the boxing, and that's I need to do. Prove my respect for boxing. Yeah, you know because the boxing is is a very interesting because not doing the disrespect for the other sports, but in boxing a lot of people die to make the sport huge. Yeah, a lot of people lost everything to make the sport huge. You know, and uh, I can't come inside the sport and don't do my best. Prove my respect for boxing. It's not about knock out Jake Paul or knock out the other opponent. It's just go inside and prove your respect for boxing work. I still think you should go in there and just hit him with a kick. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> you know, honestly, like, I would be honest. Maybe, maybe. That would be so no, dope. Funny. That would, yeah. I'm telling you. But think maybe, about it. Think about okay, it. Okay. You can do if, you are, you if you are losing, I think you just. Hit him with a downwards elbow. No, yeah, I straight up. I don't. I don't go lose. Please, I go win. Yeah, Hit him with right. the what? Kick him in the head. I go the talk. Odds. I go talk to the one percent chance. No, no, no. Please. I go talk to Jake and say, "Let's go doing the, the one more fight, but exhibition, kickboxing." And oh, please! I, he won't you do kick that. me, I can kick you. Please, right? but I promise, I don't go kick you hard. Ah, oh. I wonder when a boxer is gonna step into MMA again. It's been a while. Yeah. Who was the one guy that did it? I don't think. Remember the guy? He came into the UFC. Oh, he's a uh, Tony. Tony. Yeah. Fuck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I mean, I remember this. I don't it's know tough his name, because though. the guys don't have wrestling. I feel like that would be so. Yeah. I know. Groundwork. It wouldn't be fair, right? Yeah. But it'd be so huge if someone had the balls. And especially to like, fight huge. with uh, Randy Contour in the time. Yeah. yeah. It's crazy. He just out wrestled his ass. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, just please you know, kick him in the face. Dude. Someone should do that. Get go to the I UFC. Can. Though. I, I think it's, in the face. I, I don't just, know. Though, but why? Guy, bro. I know. No, I know. I, know. I, I think it's cooler. Could you imagine just a spinning oh, back course. kick? Oh, yeah. Imagine. <laughs> <laughs> no, I just when I, the, the the fight finished, I say, Jake, let's go doing the the other fight in the kickboxing. That'd be amazing. All right, let's go do one more. 